The sun was shining at Newton Abbott on Wednesday and there were some high profile names in action at the West Country track. All eyes were on the Tom George train grey baby mix in the two mile novices chase. The five year old was among one of the top juvenile hurdlers in the country two seasons ago but had struggled against older horses over the winter. He was sent off at 13 to 8 to get off the mark at the first attempt over fences. And he duly obliged, powering home off a strong pace throughout under Noel Feely. The winning rider couldn't hide his delight after the race, describing it as a fantastic performance and one he hopes the horse can build on. The final fence they come, Baby Mix and Noel Feely just gives him a couple of reminders to keep his mind on the job. He jumped that one almost too well, but Baby Mix lands three or four lengths clear now from Highway Code. And as debuts go, that was pretty good over fences. Baby Mix, nice to see some of the old spark, wasn't it? The best-backed horse of the day was the Jim Best-trained Planetoid, who returned a 6-5 on winner of the 2 mile one handicap hurdle. The five-year-old, having his first start in handicap company, had beaten just one horse in his last four starts, but not been seen since December. 18 times champion jockey Tony McCoy stepped in as a late replacement for Matty Batchelor, who was unable to make it to the course due to car trouble. And the pair never had much to worry about, coming home easy five-length winners. Trainer Jim Best said they had worked a lot on the horses jumping over the last six months and believed that the better ground had helped this son of Galileo. He could bid for a quick double at Fontwell on Tuesday. But he's going to do this very comfortably indeed. For Jim Best and Tony McCoy, it's Planetoid the favourite who wins pretty much as he likes. Dalrymple second in third... And the champion jockey Tony McCoy had already teamed up with champion trainer Nicky Henderson to land the two and three quarter mile novices hurdle with the grey Otto the Great. The winner returned at 11 to 8, second favourite, with Henderson's tight arrival Paul Nichols sending out the even money jolly, no loose change in second. McCoy said the winner was found an ideal race and appreciated the quick ground. From Otto the Great takes him to the lead. Otto the Great coming down, down towards the last. Seems to have no loose changes measure. Otto the Great then coming into the last flight of hurdles. Over it safely from no loose change. Who's five lengths away and can't respond. Otto the Great wins fairly comfortably. From no loose change in second. Titch Strider only just... And former useful chaser Wester Ross in the visor made the most of a sliding handicap mark to take the two-mile handicap chase for Evan Williams and Adam Wedge. The nine-year-old was rated some £22 higher last spring but had been on a downward spiral since. He rewarded those who kept the faith, returning at 8-1. to one. Ben is back in third place. It's Wester Ross and Adam Wedge proving too strong in the closing stages for Benny's quest in second. Chestnut Ben was third. In fourth place was Russian Conquest, not beaten.